and welcome to What Take As Your Waste. On this channel, I will share everything I know about how you can make things yourself to leave a little bit more zero waste with less. Today, we're gonna make soap using just one oil, coconut oil. Coconut oil is very, very cleansing, so it's perfect to use to clean your dishes or even um, in your laundry. It's very important that you really familiarize yourself with the safety measures before attempting to make your own soap. First, we're gonna weigh the coconut oil in a glass bowl. Then our sodium hydroxide, also called lye. 0% superfat is the way I formulated the recipe so that it's a little bit less moisturizing, but it's very, very cleansing, which is perfect for our purpose here. We're going then to weigh some cold tap water and after that we're going to add the lye to the water. Remember, never the opposite. If you add the water to the lye, the temperature of the water would rise dramatically, causing the lye water to erupt out of the container. Once the lye has cooled down, I will add it straight to the coconut oil um, so that the heat of the lye will melt down the coconut oil while forming the soap during the saponification reaction. This is an advanced technique, but if you want, you can simply first melt the coconut oil and then once it's completely melted and the temperature is same as the lye water or they're not more than 10 degrees apart, then you can add the lye to the coconut oil. I will use a stick blender to uh, complete the saponification reaction, not for too long because otherwise the soap butter will become way too thick and once the soap becomes thick there's no coming back point, it will just start to solidify. As you can see the lye is now fully reacted with the oil, um, it's fully incorporated, we call this medium trace, we are now ready to pour into the mold. the soap to harden in the mold for about 24 hours. Coconut oil is quite a hard oil so it will set up quite quickly. It will also uh, heat a little bit so we don't want to cover it with anything at all, just leave it at room temperature. Just go back to it the day after and you will see it will be quite hard and you're ready to unmold it.
Normally soap has to cure for at least 40 days, but since this is a cleaning soap, it can actually be used straight away. We don't mind it being a little bit alkaline. Uh, just make sure you're wearing gloves so that you protect your hands um, or the soap could be a bit drying to the skin. 100% coconut oil soap can also be used as a laundry soap. I followed the recipe from The Green Kit, which is a cleaning kit by the brand uh, The Green Boutique. In The Green Kit recipe book, it's recommended to use 100% uh, olive oil soap, which is called castor oil soap. But in this recipe, we're using 100% coconut oil soap flakes, which we're gonna grate from the soap bar we've created. And I think it's gonna work as great because coconut oil soap is super, super cleansing. So it's perfect to um, use in your laundry, not just for your dishes. To complete the laundry soap recipe, we're going to use sodium carbonate, which comes with the kit. It comes in a completely compostable plastic bag and also is quite a big quantity, so I'm sure it will last a very long time. So that's it, I really hope you enjoyed the recipes and uh, let me know what you think in the comments below. If you want to learn more about soap making and zero waste leaving, um, you can visit my website bottekazerowaste.com um, or also my Instagram bottekazerowaste.